That dungeon near gave me nightmares, but I'm thankful that's behind me. Let's continue with more of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. After all, let us properly continue on the right path. For that, however, let's take a detour. We got another shrine to complete. Let's see if we can press onwards for now. Wait a minute. Whistling Hill. Break cap. <laughs> nice blue, blue rupees. Shockies. Electric keys. <laughs> nice. At least that's done. Hardy truffle. So much for the Pacoblins. Good, I need more power. All that leads to a chest. Oh, nice. Soldier shield. Let's head on up. Ow! Stinking like like. Open your mouth, buddy. All right, very good. Oh. 
That was easy. Two shields. And a like like stone. Back up. Yes, I'm stocking up. An electric leg leg? Shock like stone. A shock like stone and a sword. Okay. Put us up there. Found something. Well, let's see what it's all about. Nice! The rubber armor! One of three pieces needed. If we get all three pieces, then we can be able to not suffer any electrical shocks. Or rather, we'd be unshockable. Okay, so now we can properly continue. We wasted about eight minutes, so, so. And we got some bright bloom seeds. We'll need those when we enter the depths. Yeah, because once that's done, then we have to head over here and unlock the next slope tower. <laughs> Gotta keep moving. Nice. That might speed it up. <laughs> yeah, right there. Right there. There it is.
also gotta stock up on more of these. The Tachi Kach Shrine. All right, let's go. Today's challenge, building with logs. That was easy. This didn't work. Okay, that's nice. Yep, I know what we have to do for this one. You gotta be kidding me. There's even more. Next log.
Need to get the chest because I wasn't gonna leave without it. Really, a spiky shield? I don't need that. I don't need that stuff. So Yeah, this is the only time I said that. Uh... Well, at least I got the chest. And thankfully, that's after the 15 minute, after the 15 second warning. I don't care. Seriously. How did that happen? Oh, yeah, because I'm using a hammer for a weapon. I forget. <laughs> Okay, that's actually rather ingenious. That's actually ingenious. Yeah, that did it. There's more than one way to solve an issue. Thank God there was. That makes a... Well, there's a shed nearby we can get. The Riverside Stable. I need my horse. Oh. 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 Time to get Epona, let's ride. Oh. Oh. I see. So Kakariko Village has been a bit lively. <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. Well, let's head above water.
I knew it. I was here before, but I never had a chance to do it now. Well, better late than never, then. I know, I know, I know. Move back, move back, move back, move back, back. Wait here, Ipana. If I can't get to it that way, then I'll do it the old fashioned way. What do these idiots want? there. How's the ring gonna stop? At least I've regained much of what I've lost. Damn that bloody gloom! Nah, there's more than one way to reach it. I'm not gonna try that method. I'll try this method instead! Like that. The Morak Shrine. St stinking gloom. Today's trial, a bouncy device.
I see. Bouncy device. This is what teaches us about the Zonite bounce. Morak Shrine. But still, I can't. No one ever told me about this. Oh, okay. You gotta use your weapon. But it's nice having a shield for it. So that's it. Alright, that takes care of two. Now I understand it. Gotta get this. It worked. 
Holy moly, it worked. Get the chest first. A sneaky elixir. Very nice. No, I'm starting to understand how this time on this thing works. You need a third spring. And there you have it, done. At least we're fully healed in the process. Now with that behind... Let's do this. There's the tower. Now that we made it, let's see if we can try to get it active again. Somebody's there. Yeah. Oh. What's going on this time? I see, so we gotta find caves at the bottom.
but they never said which cave. Yeah, I'm not very. I'm, I haven't been talkative in the news. Oh yeah, a uh, battle towers. There's the cave. Bash my way through all this? <laughs> but I went through that. Let's knock them down a few pegs. This is the case system, but... Horrible and guts. in the way
one rupee? I'm looking around. I don't see anything else. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Now we're making some bank. Bubble gems. I've covered everything around this area and then some. Come on. I already cleaned out the cave. At the bottom of the hill, huh? I already found the cave. Is there like another one I don't know about? Or is it further down? Yeah, let's get back up. Yes, this is mostly padding, but still. Hmm? 
Another Korok. We already went through that. Let's see if I'm at that spot. No. This must be it. inside Oh Yeah, there is two long sticks There you go. What? It opened? How in the world did you manage to fix it? Eh? Can't believe a couple of sticks caused all this hassle. I wonder if those were in there to begin with and just fell over somehow. Or if some monster did that on purpose. Either way, that really helped. Thank you. Well... These mechanisms aren't wearing quite white. I'll just give them a bit of oil. Ta-da! It wasn't a big problem, so a little oil cleared it up. Right, I'm gonna hurry on ahead, so this is goodbye. Okay, let's get activating. So we just got more, along with some more areas in the sky. And another area in the depths. So yeah, that's the Sahastra area all cleaned out. We still gotta take care of the one in Lanaryu. These, the rest of these areas, I will have to clear with. Yeah, 
Yeah, but what's these set of islands over here? Let's check them out. The North McClure Sky Archipelago. <laughs> ah. Minor damage. No biggie. Let's move. We found ourselves a beaut. Yep. We obtain another seed as well. If we gather four of them and offer them the Legata statue, we can deepen our connection with the sages. Well... Gotta stock up as much as you possibly can. There was a shrine here, then I can use that for fast travel. Ah, uh, now we're talking. Yep, we got a lot of luminous stones. Hmm, let's see if we can find anything interesting here. And that's an Endura Shroom. Temporarily increases your stamina. Getting those will help. Party radish. <laughs> Interesting. And we got more dazzle fruits. We got a lot of stuff in the process. And let's see what's in the I see. Let's move this here. I don't have any arrows. Well, we have plenty of time for that. And let's unlock the next tower and that's it. Yeah, much of our time is spent like... There's like so much to do in this game that it's nuts. And I only say this. Because, holy moly, you're in for a long ride. And I don't say that because it, it's tough. I say it because it is. Okay, so let us set this... Let's, let's set this pin here and let's move. Yeah, because the last time we were here, let's just say it was not pretty. I've learned my lesson the last time we did this, so we're just gonna fly through it and get it done. On the other hand, it would on the other hand, it would be a disadvanta disadvantageous. And they've now added more ro they've added robots. So it means I'm gonna have to beat them down. I'll just have to do it the old fashioned way. Let's go! Huh?
Really? Since when did you botch this? Nah, screw it. Alright, now I'm mad. You mess with me, you're not gonna like the outcome. Whacking me is not nice. Getting drenched is the one thing you don't want to do. I needed arrows anyway. Moblins? Thanks for that! I need some added momentum. Now to move fast. Once we get to that tower, that's it. We're done. Just forward. Let's move. And I wanted to ride a moose, but nope. the center before I get white. Going up! Push up! Hmm. Now I'm supposed to have something that could help. Ice fruit? No. Mushroom? No. Splash fruit. Splash What? Hey. I need to destroy destroy the fused material. That wasn't what I wanted. <laughs> Intriguing. No, you're supposed to throw the weapon. Although I find that to be rather disappointing. 
Yeah, you're actually supposed to throw throw the splash stuff, or alternatively use the splash shield, blow it away. Never really thought of it that way. Just me, now. Yeah, I need a high view. Okay, we've reached the height of point. Let's go! That's gonna help me out. further there's Zora's domain but like I said we will come back here later we're here because we got to clean up this mess all right time to use the, use the material wait a minute I think I know how to I think I know how to do this. Fuse. There you go. You have to use a jump shield trick. Alright. Hit the skies. where it's coming from we got the entirety of Zora's domain down along with the Lanair you see as well as the Lunaru Sky Archipelago. Okay, now I'm really curious. Now I'm curious. Now I'm curious as to what the hell happened here. And what's with this giant orb? Wait a minute, wait a sec, what? A shrine's inside? The Jiru Takumak Shrine. I did not see this coming. The more I play these games, the more I play this, the more I'm, more it actually piques my curiosity. All right. A flying device. No, no, no. We need the old man. Okay, we got to this part. Now the second step is basically to reach the other end. Yeah, we're gonna need a wing. We need a wing alongside a thruster. Unfortunately, our wings are not doing so hot. What in the, the hell? Come on down. Hup. 
Coming down. Damn! Missed it again! That's a skateboard! Seriously, what are you supposed to do with a skateboard? Fan of this stuff. There's another one. I gotta find a way to reach all the way up there and make sure I get it up top. One's on a skateboard. Okay, I'm starting to figure out this entire puzzle. Oh, it, no, it's off balance. That's much better. I find that to be rather interesting. But still, the fact that you get to see this all go down is just amazing. Yeah, this game... Yeah, if Breath of the Wild allowed the freedom, then Tears of the Kingdom is pretty much... Pretty much the way how you experiment and try new things. Coming in for a landing. Alright, we hit the brakes. Yeah, I'm not gonna get the treasure chest, because what's the... Yeah, we need to get out of here, because we're done. 
We at least got the dungeon done. But I didn't think we'd be fighting it all the way high up in the sky. Yeah, once I reach at least 12, I use one heart and then spend the rest on getting the stamina wheels. Because I need to fill about two stamina wheels. I need like a second, at least a two and a half. Because now we now know what's causing that goop to fall. Yeah, let's... Let's put them all in. Uh. Seriously? Oh, come on! Yep, there's more shrines up above. Even all the way from up high. On. Much better. All right. Another old map. Okay. Yeah, this is going to require me to explore a lot of this place, but I need more bright flowers. And getting those is going to help me out, be able to, able to like, light up the death so I can know where the hell to go. Bloody hell, this game. All right. Set upstairs. And... No, 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 no. Let me put this up here. I don't see any others. Yeah, I'm slowing down so that way it can catch up. So that's it. Yeah, but that one's on the other end. What to do? Do I either head up here or do I head around here? I don't see Cock Kibora Pass. Yeah, I think that'll do it. That's going to be it for this, because I'm sorry if I just keep on going. I don't want to go two hours. But at least we're getting much of the map done. The reason why we do this is twofold. So that way we find any shrines, as well as find like any new locations. But, hey, at least you guys are going to enjoy it. If not, then I'm sorry. Besides, there are still more towers I have to unlock in order for me to like clear out everything. And then I gotta start marking maps to finding out where all the shrines are. That's a hassle in and of itself. I mean, look at this. Look at this. This covers, like, much of the third area. We have Lanaryu, and then we have to go all the way down here, 
We already got Farron, and then you gotta do the same up here. The same can be set up here in the sky. Yep, device dispensers. And this is gonna require us to do a lot more, huh? And then there's also the deaths. That's gonna be tough in and of itself. So yeah, that's it. I think next time we're gonna try to head up north, so that when we do, we can be able to press forward with it. If you enjoyed, please be sure to hit the like button, it means a lot. Please do not forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell. I will see you in the next time, and believe you me, there is a lot that we need to do. So yeah, that's it. This is Mega Man NG signing off. Peace out. Sorry it's not to your liking, but yeah, I've got a lot to do. See you then.